Welcome to this undertaking video episode and my name is Timothy Profitable. This is Blevo. I want to talk to you briefly. I'm in the village right now where uh, village, our village in my home and uh, I would pertain the same. Uh, just when they have been going around somehow, somehow, but still before I go back to the city, I wanted to do that this episode and uh, uh, come out clear on some few things. I've had so many people we are talking about and someone asked me, why don't you just concentrate on spiritual matters of your life and concentrate on your calling? And uh, people asking this kind of question, they forget one thing, that a calling of a man is in other people. <laughs> yeah, when you say you are called, it definitely means you are called for other people. And the business of setting up for the other people is what makes you stand out as a called man. You cannot be called for yourself. You are called for of. other people. And uh, this is what Paul was talking about. And he said for others, he made them prophets, others pastors, others evangelists, teachers, and others apostles and all this in the body of the fivefold ministry we have one major purpose to build the entire body of Christ so everybody has an assignment everybody has an assignment so you have an assignment anything you do you have an assignment in the body of Christ whatever you do whatever you manifest you have an assignment in the body of Christ so you are dating I mean, you have a debt of this world as long as now you are called into an office. Another thing I want to make clear to everybody that really listens to this channel is that Christ Jesus and salvation is constant. Whatever we say here does not make sure we change Christ. No, we do this with the confirmation that we were already for Christ way back before we start talking about this. It's just a leadership concept of what we can do. Are we together? Now that the people coming in all say, oh, now where you are, oh, oh, you do your thing. Another one comes in and we saying this. We are doing the thing God has set us to do. There are others that are stationed. There are people you can't even know they are in the calling of God. Like, let me say, for example, when God called Moses from the mountain of fire, I mean, uh, uh, there on the burning bush, and then he talked about, uh, I'm calling you. Later on, God comes in and say, now I send someone. And he made sure this man was described. God is talking now to Moses. I'm sending someone to you to help you in the body in the building, in the blacksmithing, in every other thing. He was called by God. But in details, if you check, they were servants of God. Now, in the body of Christ, we will have prophets who prophesy to us. We have mothers, we have fathers, we have people who want to talk to us. But in the end of the day, we will lack one person, whether to do or not to do. There will always be somebody that we stand on the gap to start making things roll on and roll out. Now, I know I'm trying just to move. I'm moving the, uh, deliberately, okay? I'm moving deliberately so that you can see this is a house under construction. We are summarizing the construction. Now, a lot of things that are set and uh, we are setting. Uh, that man is, uh, is also helping in some work down here. And uh, he he's realized he's almost intruded, but it's fine. But uh, I know you understand what I'm doing. I deliberately made this video here that you know God can station manifestation in different forms. I am your servant at your disposal, apostle, or rather you can call me handyman of God, handyman for you. Everybody else will know that we are here to be servants to everybody. Timothy Profitable, and this is Blevoy. 
we handle your spirituality, economic, and social matters. See you in the next episode. God willing. Easy.